Anything all? I'll be with you in a minute. Just let me handle this. If you allow me, thank you. Okay, boom and boom. So yeah, confirm. Appreciate the share, whoever that was. Somebody shared this as well. Someone shared this, but uh, anyway. Right, just let me do these. Uh, this little uh, thing, setting up everything and that. Uh, ladies and gents, this is GMW Underground. In two weeks, Underground will not be here. I'll explain more during the show. Uh, Underground will not be here in two weeks, but like I guess I'll explain during the show. Um, But uh, tonight you've got the fifth instalment, the fifth episode of GMW Underground. We're going to kick off with WW with GMW's latest signee, Mister. Okay, shoot. We're going to kick off with w with their GMW's letter signee, Lars Sullivan. He's going to go one-on-one -on -one with Cody again. Rematch from Thursday as well, but I'll explain during the show. Yours truly goes against Alex Siva, one half of the newly crowned World Tag Team Champions. And then I'm going to have a little chat. Cam Martin one-on-one -on -one with Loco Joe, the World Television Champion. And then Moxley's going to have a chat, and then he's going to have to go two-on-one -on -one with uh, the Mafia members. He's beaten them twice. He's beaten them both in singles matches, but tonight, can he beat them? Can he do the impossible and beat them in the handicap match? I don't think so. Hopefully, he gets his ass kicked. And then it's Ray Wolf one-on-one -on -one with the Big Amish. A mixed tag match, ladies and gents. A mixed tag team match as your... Um, as your single, as your co-main event of the evening, ladies and gentlemen, it is Liv Killer and her brother Killer to go up against Coley Masters and Billy Paragon. That should be interesting. Uh, that should be very interesting. Okay, we'll see what happens. But your main event of the evening, ladies and gents, is not that. It's this. Pennywise has made an impact. The daughter of the male Pennywise that I have has made an impact. And tonight she challenges Mercedes for the Women's Championship. The main event, Ray Wolf versus the Big Amish. Loco versus Cam Martin, and much more. This is ground. And then we do that. And there we go. A distribution, put you in there. And why not put you in there as well? If I put a thingy in here, no I haven't, so I'll just leave it as it is. And yeah. Uh, let me just put this in here, because it is underground. It's an old picture of the underground, but if I could find it, it's not in here, because I'm in the logos. I'm an idiot. There we go. So, ba-boom. Let's go. So that's your matches for tonight, ladies and gents. And like I say, 
Uh, ooh, 333 uh, people like this page. Very much appreciated of that. And I'm also not far away from 5K followers on the Facebook. So, with that being said, ladies and gentlemen, in a couple of weeks, um, we've got this week and then next week's GM and W Underground. Um, I think I have an idea f for what I'm going to do for that episode, but we'll see. Um, but for next week's episode will be the last episode for two weeks. Because after that, it will take a two-week break. It will be off the following week. We've got 13th today. Let me just break it down for you. It'll be more easy. Oh, shoot. Forgot something. Arr! Right, let me do that first. I forgot about that. Hang on. I'll go back home. But yes, 13th is today. And then we've got the 20th next week. And then after that... The 13th this week and the 20th next week. And then after that, it won't be back. GMW Underground will be back, but it won't be back until uh, the 6th of March. Because on February 27th, I will be over on Twitch. Because um, the, what I call it, the pay-per-view, all the pay money can buy, will be streamed live on Twitch. It won't be streamed on here. It'll be streamed live on Twitch if you want. But uh, you will get your, you will get it on here. Thank you for the like, whoever that was. I really do appreciate it. Let me just uh, thank you up here. I know I've got some lag on here. So I just, uh, Lobo, thank you for the like. And apparently that was me who was, who was liked in that page as well. But anyway, who shared the page. But in any event... Be that as it may. So yeah, um, it will be on that pay. It will be on that day. So, we'll, like I say, we just have to wait and see um, what happens on there now. So, uh, but you will get it. Facebook will get the pay per view. It will. They will get the replay. Don't get me wrong. They will get the replay. It'll probably be the next day. Hopefully in the morning. But, uh, like I said, they will get the pay-per-view. It'll either be the next day or Monday, but, uh, yeah. If you want to see it streamed, it won't be streamed live here on the channel. Um, but, you, like I said, you will... You will get the pay-per-view. You will get the pay-per-view, no doubt about it. Right. Where's my seams? There it is. So, yeah. So, that's going to happen in a couple of weeks. So, next week, you're here. And you have... Um, what I call it. You will have it next week. Um, you will have the uh, the episode next week, which is the sixth instalment of uh, of uh, GMW Underground. But uh, the week after, it will take a break. Now, what I'm thinking of doing is coming on for that to do a what I call it um, to do a uh, a preview show but I'm thinking of doing that preview show on Friday to save all the hassle as well so I think that week leading into the pay-per-view I'm pretty much going to be streaming Mondays and Fridays on here on Facebook just to make up for lost time and everything and I will try and do six hours that week just to make up for lost time um, as well so I will do three hours I don't normally do that on here i do two and a half if i can or it depends what it is but the main stable is twitch as you guys all well know so yeah it will be on that week and um, it will be on that week so like i say you will still get the pay-per-view it will be streamed live it will be replayed here on here i will upload the it on here 
So you will still get the pay-per-view, but it'll be streamed live on Twitch that week. So February 27th, there'll be no GMW Underground. So GMW, after the 20th, will not return until the 6th of March. So you will, like I said, I am not taking um, GMW Underground off. It just, you'll have a break that week. So you'll have a break from GMW Underground that week, but it'll be back on the 6th of March as well. So all is good on that week as well. So, so it'll be back on the 6th of March um, that week as well. So like I said, we'll see what happens. So there'll be the go-home shows. And then there'll be no need for an underground show. It'll be a go home show. There'll be no need for an underground show. And then on the sixth of March, and like I said, I'm just testing that out. I might, I might have an, an underground show still, and then go to the pay per view the next day. Uh, going forward as well, depending if this works or not. This works or not. But uh, like I say, Sunday is my day off, so that's the reason why I'm putting the pay per views on the sat Saturday. Because Sunday is normally my day off um, from streaming, um, and that's so. Well, like I said, we'll we test the waters out. I don't want to be streaming too much. You know, you've got to have a day off here and there, maybe a couple, depending on what you want. But uh, I don't know. I'm thinking of having a day off on Monday this this coming week. So, like I said, we'll see what happens either way. Um, so yeah, ladies and gents, it is now time for the one and only GMW Underground. As you clearly see there, we have the Women's Championship on the line, Mercedes Challenge, Mercedes Defense against Pennywise. We've got Lars Sullivan in action, yours truly is going to be in action today. We've got Cam Martin one-on-one -on -one with Loco Joe. Handicap match, Moxley against the Mafia. Ray Wolf against Big Amish and a mixed tag match as well. All tonight here on the one and only GMW Underground. So ladies and gentlemen, it is a Saturday evening or Saturday afternoon or wherever it is you may be. This is Facebook and ladies and gentlemen, this is Games Matter Wrestling. This is GMW Underground. We don't care. Championship, Cam Martin, local Joe, Belfast, Northern Ireland. Are you in for a treat tonight? Oh, this is GMW Underground. Let's go. Right, we kick off with Lars Sullivan. Lars Sullivan, one on one with Cody tonight. Now, last week, Thursday, in fact. These two wrestled on GMW, and Cody pulled off an upset. Um, Sullivan made his debut on Tuesday and destroyed Raymond Groves. But Cody put off, pulled off an upset on Thursday when these two wrestled, and Sullivan ain't happy. So this is the rematch, and this is Sullivan's debut here on GMW Underground. Also, will Sullivan be able to... Pull the uh, will Sullivan be able to pull in the proverbial win and get a win back? 
after what happened. Like I say, I was shocked what happened last week on Thursday. I never expected that from Cody. Well, Lars, right the wrong. We're about to find out, ladies and gentlemen, in your opening contest. Here on GMW Underground. Anyway, here he is, Cody. He's about to go one on one. He must shock the system. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Orlando, Florida. Weighing in at 220 pounds. Mr. Dentzler himself, Cody. I'm gonna go one on one with Lars Sullivan. You beat him on Thursday, can he beat him again tonight? I highly doubt that, but you never know. Also, as well, guys, I will be rearranging the the um what are cards this weekend as well. I might do it after the stream. The rings, everything is going to be different starting next Tuesday as well, ringside at least. Uh, there'll be no um, water carts on there as well, but like I say, things are going to be a little, little bit different. There'll be no more steel guardrails this week, so we'll see what happens. <sighs> Lars Sullivan. And his opponent from the Rocky Mountains. Weighing in at 303 pounds. Lars Sullivan. This big monster is looking for revenge tonight. Will he get it? Like I say, Cody shocked the world when he beat the big man. Maybe Lars underestimated Cody. Lars Sullivan released from WWE. And we're going straight into GMW. Both men ready. Referee rings the bell. Call the elbow tie up. Side headlock. And an arm wrench. Into a hammerlock. Wrestling to keep this going. And then reverse into an arm bar. Beautiful wrestling by the freak. Cody rolls through and gets it in there as well. Call the elbow tie up again. Side headlock by Cody. Cody off the ropes. And a big forearm and a boot from Sullivan. Big power bomb. High impact offense kick. Cody counters that. Kind of bow tie up. Side headlock. And an arm wrench away. Suplex. Nope, just a suplex slam, I suppose you can call that from, La from Lars. Lars now. Knee and a kick. And another kick. Boot to the midsection. Another boot. Driving it into the heart. And another boot again. This is better from Sullivan. And a flapjack. Nothing fancy about that. You're coming down to the rough landing. 
And backbreaker into a slam. First cover in the match. One. I mean one cup though. Opening contest here on GMW Underground. Episode 5. Episode 6 will be next week. Boot to the midsection. Beautiful power bar. Another boot. Sam again just driving the boot right into that chest. That chest is now a red from that boot. Boot to the midsection again. Clubbing bow to the back. And a clothesline. And Cody goes to the outside, tries to create that space. Doesn't do it though. Cody again. Like a stronger slam. Cover. Referee. Somewhat out of position as always. But Sullivan gets a one count. Yep. A roundhouse. Beautiful. There's that Sullivan slam coming up. He hits it. That's it, surely. One, two. Sullivan gets a receipt. Beautiful from Lars Sullivan. Too bad he didn't do that on Thursday. Lars Sullivan, dominant here on Underground. And puts Cody in his place. There's that slam. And one, two, three. Lars Sullivan not working by the hour. Proves that if you do beat him, Every person has a bad day, ladies and gentlemen, and if you do beat him, you will pay a price. And boy, did Cody pay a price right there and then. Lars Sullivan, your victor here at the opening contest here on GMW Underground. Excellent work from Mr. Sullivan. What's next for Lars? I guess we'll find out on Tuesday. But for now, he gets even with Cody. So, coming up next, Alex Seaver, one half of the now newly crowned World Tag Team Champions. Um, Alex Seaver and War won the World Tag Team Challenge this past Thursday. He's going to have a wrestling match, one-on-one -on -one wrestling match with yours truly. That's right. And I've barred War from ringside for this matchup as well. So it'll be me and Mr. Seaver one-on-one. But Seaver's been using my finishing move. And I don't like it one bit. So I have to teach this man a lesson, I'm afraid. And plus, I have to teach him a lesson as well because he beat, like I said, they beat the Mafia on Tuesday, on uh, Thursday rather, for the uh, World Tag Team titles. So it is one on one. It's yours truly, and Alex Seaver. Also, still to come, Cam Martin one on one with the World Television Champion Loco Joe. If Cam wins, he will get a championship match. Um, all will be explained as well later on. Also, Ray Wolf one on one with Big Amish. And uh, who else? Oh, yes, Mr. Moxley will be here as well. And he goes in a handicap match against Orange Juice Jones and Goldberg. He's beaten them in singles matches. Can he beat them both at the same time? You know, Moxley's hell continues as we lead into February 27th. Because on February 27th, it will be John Moxley defending the World Championship against. Me. And don't forget the main event today. For the women's championship, it will be Mercedes defending against Pennywise. And that match will be no disqualification. Second match of the evening here on GMW Underground. And there he is. Alex Seaver, and there's the World Tag Team title belt. 
because him and War are now the World Tag Team Champions. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from parts unknown. Weighing in at 205 pounds. One half of the... And I think they may very well defend the belts uh, next week. I haven't decided yet. But uh, Alex Siva walking now with the World Tag Team titles. War and Alex Siva win the World Tag Team Championships from the Mafia this past week. Mafia being the UK collective as well, by the way. So here comes yours truly, the boss, GMW owner, leader of the Wolfpack Mafia. Representing the NWO Wolfpack. You damn right. From Newcastle upon Tyne, England, weighing in at 260 pounds, the superstar, Anthony. Walker. That's me. And for for your record, ladies and gentlemen, I am from North East, but I'm not from Newcastle, just for the record, okay? I am from the North East of England, but I'm not from Newcastle, just to be on the, uh, the proverbial safe side, if you will. I am, but I'm not from Newcastle, just to let you know. Um... Just to let you all know, ladies and gents. So. I have an issue with this man, Alex Seaver. Apparently Alex is uh, walking around or going around using my uh, proverbial move. Hopefully we will settle, settle this score tonight. Seaver versus me right now. Let's go. Here we go. Coming elbow tie up again. Tell you what, everybody's come to wrestle tonight. Hammerlock by the boss. And then an armbar by Alex, one half of the World Tag Team Champions. I've been a former World Tag Team Champion as well, former hardcore champion. Never been a world champion in my company. I am a current LCW champion. Look at that slap. Don't fuck with me and my mood, boy. Kind of a tie up again. Push Mr. Seaver back in the corner. This is a wrestling match, it's not a hardcore match. It's a one on one straight up map. Wrestling match. Hopefully, it'll be a wrestling match. You never know with the uh, Seaver. Elbow there. Kind of a tie up. Go behind. Wrestling takedown to side headlock. And. Brings it back up into a headlock of his own, does the boss. And a headlock takedown. Hey, well, everybody's came to wrestle tonight, it seems. First two matches, there's been chain wrestling. See even now. And a right hand again, and a running boot. Rocks the big man, but see if he gets the advantage again. Irish whip in the corner. And I reverse that. And the shoulder tackles. I'm in full effect here for the World Tag Team Champion. Neck breaker. Vicious neck breaker. And another light suplex. Kip up there from the boss and the running knee. Knocks me down. And the World Tag Team Champion going to work on the boss. He said they don't want to Cross the Mafia, that's a Michinoku drive is what that was. And with my own finishing move too. With my own finishing move. Apparently that was his trademark move. Oh my god.
through to the midsection. And a clothesline for me. Time to put this cat away and do it quick. Goes for a power slam, counters. And another running knee. I am in a little bit of trouble here and I don't like it. Clubbing blow. Another neck breaker. Smartly rolls to the apron. Creates that space. And knee and... Ref count you more on. One, two. One, two. One, one, two. Oh, well, one then. One, two. Back and forth stuff here. One, two. Eventually kicks out. Great wrestling so far. Clubbing blow to the back. Through to midsection. Irish whip. Right hand. Superplex on the outside, and quite frankly, he deserves this. Oh my god. Superplex to the outside, ladies and gents. I'm going to kip up, knee and a an, uh, kick and a knee and a roundhouse kick and a sweep. How to keep up with that. Roundhouse kicks again. Power slam. DDT on the leg. Oh no. Nine. And it's a double card out. Okay. The double card out. So I'll tell you what I'm going to do this Tuesday. We'll have the rematch. And it will be hardcore rules. I'm going to have a little chat now. It will be hardcore rules this Tuesday. We will have another co contest. And it will be hardcore rules this Tuesday. So here we go. Get rid of him. I'll deal with you on Tuesday, Siva. Be a hardcore match on Tuesday. February 27th is probably the biggest pay per view, or one of the biggest pay per views this year. And it's all the pain money can buy. And your main event has been set. So, John Moxley. I hope you saw what I just did to the World Tag Team Champion. Because that's going to be you. I will deal with him on Tuesday, though. You see, Jackass? You started this. I screwed you out of the championship at Living for the Glory. You started this by going to Cody. And yes, Cody beat me. And on the very first edition of Underground, you win against Hannibal Black to get a title shot. And then, unfortunately, the bullshit went down.
That bullshit being you hitting mock, you hitting the big Amish with a steel chair in your match at Breakthrough and getting the, ch the win. You cheated, pretty much. Even though it was a no disqualification match, but you pretty much dropped something stupid on that. And at, on, and at the pay-per-view, I'm going to get my revenge. Because one way or another, Moxley, I have some promises to fulfill. And I've got one promise to fulfill at February 27th on pay-per-view on Twitch, streamed live for the whole world to see. I am going to take you out. And I am going to reclaim the GMW Undisputed Heavyweight Championship. This all started at Living for the Glory, and I promise you, from here on out right now, I promise you, I am not taking any prisoners, no matter what you throw at me or what I throw at you, February 27th, punk, I will be GMW Undisputed World's Heavyweight Champion. Take that to the bank. One way or another, I'm going to take the title. Or oh, I die trying this on February 27th, streamed live on Twitch. Saturday night, February 27th, all the paid money can buy. It will be John Moxley defending the World Championship against yours truly. And I hope by May, March 6th, Underground, to have that World Championship belt in my possession. Right, third match of the evening. Kaman, one on one with Loco Joe. And Kaman has been shooting his mouth off. Oh boy. Especially what happened on Thursday. This git has the audacity, and I mean the audacity, to come out on, to, on GMW this past week. And declaring that he wants to be a champion here in GMW. And I'll admit, he's, had, he's been close on occasions. I mean, if Keller had retained on GMW Dynamite last uh, a week before the Living for the Glory pay-per-view, if Keller had retained, Cam Martin would have faced Keller at the pay-per-view. The Living for the Glory pay-per-view for the World TV title. But Keller got destroyed by the Big Amish. And lost his belt. And his second title reign didn't last long. Because he lost it to Loco. On uh, Underground. So. He hasn't. He, he's kind of been there in the title picture. But then he's fell out of it. Pretty much. And this past week he came out and says he wants to be a champion. So badly. So I've decided to give him an opportunity. He wrestles Loco here tonight. Loco the man who declared him a future champion by the way. But if he wrestles Loco here tonight and wins, he will get a championship match against Loco at some point. He's not well liked. I think you can probably tell. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Charlotte, North Carolina, weighing in at 412 pounds. Cam Martin. Will he be in line for a championship match? Like I said, Big Amish is scheduled to get a TV championship match at some point. Obviously, it won't be so soon, I suppose, because um, cause Ma cause Big Amish is in the uh, ladder match February 27th. And here he is. Loco Joe, the world television champion. And his opponent from Oakland, California, 
weighing in at 218 pounds, one half of the local Joe. He's one fourth of the Lobos because he's the leader of the Los Loco Lobos, but he's the reigning GMW World Television Champion. Former World Heavyweight Champion, former World Tag Team Champion. And if if Cam beats him tonight, he may be in line, Cam Martin that is, for a World TV title shot. Local Joe, very proud to have won that World Television title belt from Killer last week on GMW Underground. Due to shenanigans and everything, and me restarting the match, Local is your World Television Champion. Will Coloco be able to shut up Cam tonight? Here, your third match of the evening here on GMW. Here we go. Cam Martin, Loco Joe, one on one. Cam wins, he gets a title shot. And Loco go for the Loco effect right off the bat. Clubbing blow to the back. And there's the Loco effect. He got it the second time. Roundhouse kick. Misses. Right hand. Loco wrestles him and hits him with the back. Loco Joe. Crafty veteran, ladies and gentlemen. One fourth of the Lobos, the leader of the Los Loco Lobos. Runs off the apron and runs the knee. We're going to shut up Cam Martin here tonight, here on GMW Underground. And a... Ow, that shot. Loco bounces back, though. Loco. Beats up. Cam takes the fight to Cam Martin. Cam Martin now in trouble. Loco grabs him. Elbows to the gut by Cam Martin. Martin looking to create that space. And bar and oh that basement drop kick right to the leg. Now rock the big man. And a rocker dropper. Or famous or whatever you want to call it. Still the same move. A very unique offense there from Loco. I think Loco was going for the um the local crazy knee, but he didn't get him. Loco's tag team partner and best friend is in action later on tonight. Ray Wolf, he goes one on one with Big Amish, the former world champion. Them two are a part of the Money in the Bank ladder match, which will be up later on this evening. Don't worry, guys, if you're not here for the live stream, that's fair enough. Everybody has their shit to do and everything like that. This will be up on the channel when it's done. Side headlock takedown. Hopefully it'll be up on Twitch, YouTube, and that tomorrow. And there's a dragon screw into a leg lock. A unique offense from Local Joe. Cover of the match. Very rare the referee gets into a perfect position, but he was in he was in that occasion. Oh, that shot to the gut there. Loco Joe just got belly to belly suplex back in from the apron by Cam Martin, but Loco gets right back up from it. Rollins kicking in on Loco. Loco now with Cam. What's he going to do? Puts him there. Close lands him to the outside. Loco, what's he going to do? I move up the ref. I was you, ref. Plunge our ballot, Loco, on Cam Martin. 
And he enjoyed that. And the crowd enjoyed it too. Excellent work by Loco. Double leg takedown. Cam getting the hell beaten out of him by the World Television Champion. And a clothesline by the World TV Champion. And Cam throws Loco back in the ring. German suplex by Cam. I think Cam's looking for that uh, that Claymore boot as well. That's a backbreaker. A lot of power by Cam. Loco in a little bit of trouble here. Martin. That's an F5, is it? It is. Has he beaten the World TV Champion? One, two, and only a two count though. The World TV Champion gets out of it. Belly the back side suplex. Vicious side suplex there. Close line by Loco. Close line again. Loco went outside to create that space and he's worked perfectly. Two close lines and a power slam. Loco in a little bit of trouble here, as well as his cam. That's a German suplex into a Raymaker. Cam now setting up Loco. Will he put Loco away? Loco. F5, that's it. First time he kicks out, second time, that surely is it. One, two, and Cam Martin beats Local Joe. Cam Martin proves himself very well. I got to admit, proves himself very well. A little bit of respect there from Loco, for Loco. Even Loco liked that. But will Cam Martin be able to do it when the time is right? We will see. Cam Martin, your victor. Now for the heavyweight champion of the world. The world heavyweight champion, unfortunately. Here we go. Let's see what he has to say. The World Heavyweight Champion. Living for the glory. I lost my World Heavyweight Championship due to some shenanigans from the owner of this company. And he doesn't like the fact that I'm once again world heavyweight champion. So he booked himself against me at all the paid money could buy. Well, let me tell you something, boss. I smell a rat. Except this time, at all the paid money could buy, you can't do what you did at Living for the Glory. If you want the world title, 
you're going to have to beat me for it. And I'll be damned if that's going to happen anytime soon. But let me throw a little challenge to you, boy. We all know deserving as I am to be heavyweight champion of the world. How about we do this? You, me. Yeah. Let's have ourselves a hardcore match. But let's make it a little bit interesting instead. That's right. I propose we have a... A match where there's no disqualifications, no count outs, no nothing, no excuses, just you and me for one title. And you know what? As confident as I am, I'll let you pick the stipulation. One way or another, no matter what it is, I am the World Heavyweight Champion and I will be the World Champion going in. And I will be world champion coming out. And if you don't believe me, watch what I do to your boys tonight. And I would recommend you watch. Because what I'm going to do to your boys is what I'm going to do to you. Oh, is that so, big man? Okay. Okay, big shot. Whoa, 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 whoa. Where are you going? You seemed ready. Okay. You seemed ready. Will Moxley still be champion after the pay-per-view? But Moxley, where you going, brother? Get your ass back in the ring. Because since you're out here, we might as well have the match. Now. Time to put your money where your mouth is. Let's send the boys out. And how about we just do this now? Keep you in the ring. Let's send the boys out. Let's have the two-on-one handicap match now, which is the first half main event of this episode, ladies and gentlemen. Goldberg and Orange Juice Jones versus the heavyweight champion. Let's put the money where your mouth is, big boy. Eh? Must have come out here and shoot his mouth off. That's fine. So here we go. Ring the bell, ref. Two on one, punk. Have fun. Get him, boys. Goldberg. He's beaten both of these men, Moxley that is, he's beaten both of them two on one on one competition. Let's see if he can beat them both in a handicap match. My opinion, he got lucky on Thursday against OJJ. Absolute luck. The luck was real on Thursday, let me tell you. The luck was real, but this Tuesday as well, Moxley... We'll have to wrestle. He probably got a laugh out of the uh, local Joe match. Because this Tuesday, your main event for Tuesday's episode, it will be local Joe versus John Moxley. Television champion versus world champion this Thursday. Boot to the midsection by Moxley. Moxley bomb, I suppose he calls that. But Goldberg's back in. Goldberg now lifts him up, Gorilla Press, into Spinebuster. Viciousness by the by the uh, the enforcer of the mafia. Moxley trying to fight back. Elbow by uh, OJJ. Belly to back suplex by Goldberg. Get on him, boys. Beat the hell out of him. Don't forget, ladies and gentlemen, Tuesday. Oh, what a super kick that was. 
Tuesday and Thursday, GMW this Tuesday and Thursday, only on the Twitch channel, twitch.tv forward slash games matter underscore. So let me write that in here, twitch.tv slash games matter underscore. If I can put that in. TV there and pin that up on the comment board. So there you go. Moxley will pull out all the stops, ladies and gentlemen. There's no question about that. He will pull out all the stops to make sure to make sure that he can be. You know, he'll win this any way he can. If given the opportunity. He'll win this any way he can. Beautiful clothesline from behind by the world's heavyweight champion. I think he was going to go for the knee there, but local, but OJJ rather got back up. Moxley slam on Goldberg. That takes one person out of the equation. But OJJ with a German suplex on Goldberg, on Moxley, the heavyweight champion. Goldberg now. Moxley in trouble. Orange Juice Jones with Gold with Moxley. Suplex to the outside of that. And you, you know what? Personally, I love that. That makes me happy. As you know, ladies and gentlemen, all the paid money can buy Saturday night, February 27th. It will be Moxley defending the world championship against yours truly. The boss. The head Anthony Walker himself. Head Anthony Walker, also the leader of the mafia. I am the leader of the mafia. That's why my boys. Hopefully we'll do the business tonight and take care of business for me. Soften up Mr. Moxley for the 27th. When I bring that world championship back to the Mafia. Air Raid slammed by the world champion though. On Orange Juice Jones. Cover. Ref Almeida a little slow there but in any event. Suplex. A beautiful suplex at that. Suplex again. And another suplex. Into a German suplex. Two belly to backs and a German. There's the spear. That's what Goldberg was looking for. One. Two. And Moxley kicks out of it. Work together, boys. What a right head by Goldberg. OJJ, step back, OJJ. Let him do his thing. That's fine. Let him jackhammer him straight to hell. That's fine. I like what I see. Jackhammer. Back off. Oh, OJJ, one, two. Beautiful. Mwah. Perfect. That was perfect. OJJ wanted to kick his head off. OJ. Uh, Goldberg wanted to speed him. Goldberg picked him up, speed him. Hits him with a jackhammer. Good night, world champion. And the world champion's definitely going to have a headache as well because this Tuesday he will go one on one with Local Joe in the main event. That's right, Local Joe versus Moxley. World champion versus television champion this Tuesday. Beautiful spear. Wolfpack win it. The technician, OJ, J, and Goldberg, the Wolfpack. Indeed. So, Moxley can beat them one on one, but he can't beat them two on one. And he paid the price for it tonight. That's why, ladies and gentlemen, no matter who you are, you don't cross the mafia. Will he be able to do that to me February 27th? I highly doubt that. Coming up next, right after this, ladies and gentlemen, it is Ray Wolf one-on-one -on -one with the Big Amish. That's coming up right after this. Ladies and gentlemen, that was your first half of GMW. Let's get right into the second half of GMW Underground, shall we? We don't care.
That's right, ladies and gents. Second half underway. Still to come here on GMW Underground. Coming up next, it's Ray Wolf and Big Amish. We have a mixed tag match here tonight as your co-main event. It is Liv Killer and Killer to go up against Corey Masters and Billy Paragon. And then it's the Women's Championship main event of the evening, which is Mercedes defending against Pennywise. That's right, the female Pennywise, the daughter of the male version. Will the male be very proud daddy tonight and walk and see his daughter walk away as women's champion? going to find out later on but coming up next Ray Wolf one on one with the big Amish these two have competed and these two will compete in the money in the bank ladder match this coming February 27th as well these two will compete in the money in the bank ladder match February 27th streamed live on the Twitch channel but now these two go one on one tonight. Ray Wolf representing the Lobos. His best friend had a losing effort this past week. Or this earlier on tonight against Cam Martin. Making his way to the ring from Oakland, California. Weighing in at 175 pounds. Ray Wolf. Ray Wolf, the six men that will compete in that ladder match at all the paid money could buy. It will be Logan Storm. It will be Mr. O.A., very familiar to Ray Wolf. Logan Storm, Mr. O.A., Ray Wolf, Big Amish, to the man. I forgot the other one. <laughs> Big Amish, to the man, Logan Storm. I forgot what the other one is. Shit. Ah, sugar. So we've got Tuberman, Ray Wolf, Big Amish, Logan Storm, Mr. O.A. I forgot the other one. I generally have forgot the other one. Um, let me see if I can find it while this is taking place. He's a jump, Big Amish. New attitude and all. The former world television champion and world heavyweight champion. From Indiana, weighing in at 402 pounds, the superstar. Open. Right. Let's see if I can find it. Uh. This here. Oh, yes. Oh, and Punishment Martinez, of course. That's right. Punishment Martinez, Ray Wolf. Punishment Martinez, Ray Wolf, Tuberman, Mr. OA, and Logan Storm. They're the six men that will compete in that ladder match. And Big Amish got there. An instant classic against Andrew Eaton this past week as well. I believe that was on Tuesday. An instant classic. Classic confrontation. Big Amish won by cat out. But he managed to get the victory eventually and get himself into the uh, ladder match. Like I said, the match has been promised the World Championship match. He's been promised the World TV Championship match. But he's definitely been promised the World Championship match uh, as well. He's definitely been promised the World Title match. It's, will he beat, can he beat Ray Wolf in this contest right here? One on one. Ray Wolf, Big Amish. Here we go. Ray Wolf, Dragon Screw Legwood picks the ankle. Of oh, the big man. Irish whips the big man. Beautiful dragon uh, Japanese arm drag. Nice and deep. Ooh, bit of MMA from Mr. Ray Wolf here. To open up the contest. Against the big Irish. Knee to the back. Ray Wolf. 
in control. Big Amish though using the power. The power advantage is with Big Amish. There's no question. No doubt about that. Power advantage is with the Big Amish. Elbow. Kick to the back. Beautiful slam. Oh, yeah. Combinations there from Ray Wolf. And Amish rolls back, rolls, uh, falls right into the corner. Boot to the midsection. Amish. Using, trying to use that power. Trying to use what brought him to the dance. And a right hand. Reverse DDT position into the bro slam. A lot different Ray Wolf here, ladies and gentlemen. A lot different Ray Wolf. What a running boot. Vicious running boot there. One, only a one count though. One for the neck breaker. Amish with the power. Carters it into a neck breaker of his own. Nicely done by the big man. Going for a choke slam. Will he hit the choke slam? He does. Vicious choke slam. Cover. Two count only. Amish in control. Ray Wolf. Still in the matchup. And there's the neck breaker that, that Ray was looking for. Irish whip reversal in the corner. Amish now needs to maintain the control. Amish thrown to the outside though. Ray with a counter there. He's going for something. Oh my god, DDT! It's it! Ref has a 10 count to work with. Some awesome sh wrestling here tonight on GMW Underground. One arm spine buster ain't going to help matters. One arm spine buster is not going to help matters for Ray Wolf. That might have an effect on Ray, let me tell you. What's going to happen here? Tombstone. Amish Tombstone. One, two. Oh, and Ray kicked out. I swear the foot was underneath the rope there a little bit there, referee. But either way, Ray kicked out of that. Nicely done. Ray in a lot of trouble here. Elbows, and there's the... Slam there. One, two... And Amish kicks out. Great match so far between these two. And there's the MMA stuff again from Ray. Beating up the big man. And a boot. An arm drag takedown. Amish in a little bit of trouble here. But Amish bounces back. Goes for the clothesline. Ray ducks that. Irish whip. Japanese arm drag. Amish right back up. Boot to the midsection and a boot there. And a forearm. Flattens the big man. Ray in a little bit of control. Amish with a little bit of trouble here, but as soon as I say that. Amish with that power advantage throws Ray around like a rag doll. Goes for the choke slam, doesn't get it. Ray with a quick boot right into the gut area. Ray, running boot, in the corner, 
They call Big Amish very well. One, two, and only a two count though. Amish sets back up. I would watch yourself there, Ray, big boy. Running super kick. Boy, did he hit Barmish with that. Boot to the midsection. Wolf's Den coming up. The Wolf's Den. Cover. One, two. Ray Wolf with a victory. Big, big, big win for Ray Wolf here tonight on Underground. Oh my God, what a kick that was. Boot that was even. I think that only got him a two count though. But Ray Wolf gets the victory. Ray Wolf with the victory. Big, big win for Ray Wolf. And I'll tell you what's going to happen. I see this on Tuesday. How about we have this? The Los Loco Lobos. Pushman Martinez and Ray Wolf in a tag team match against the Big Amish and his tag team partner, Tuba Man. I see that for Tuesday. And Logan Storm can have a rematch with Mr. OA on Tuesday too, if that could fit it in. As well. Mix tag team match coming up. Here we go. Now, thank you for the like there, George. Appreciate that. We do indeed. We have Liv Killer, who last time wrestled Colleen Masters. It was in an Extreme Rules match, and Colleen beat her. And we all know the feud between, or the, the going on feud at the moment between Killer and uh, Billy Pogan, because it was Killer who ended the title reign of Billy Pogan, and Billy's not very happy with that as well. So I've decided to make this match your co-main event of the evening. It is a mixed tag team match. Mixed tag match. Mixed tag team encounter. This is your co-main event of the evening. And let's not forget the main event is also coming up right after this as well. And it is for the Women's Championship. No disqualifications, no excuses. Mercedes defends against Pennywise, the daughter of the male one. That's coming up right after this mixed tag match. Here we go. Mixed tag team encounter. Killer and Live Killer coming up. Now 
There's Liv. Liv, the sister of Killer. So it's a brother and sister tag team tonight. Champions! Liv Killer will be eyeing up the women's championship match later on this evening as well. She'll be looking to get a women's title match. A women's world championship match. Liv Killer. to eye up her brother will be on the way There he is, Killer, former two-time TV champion, lost the belt to uh, Loco last week, he'd be eyeing up an opportunity to get it back. It's going to be Liv Killer and Killer in this mixed tag match against Colleen Masters and Billy Paragon. I'm just watching some TikTok, ladies and gentlemen, while these entrances are going on. to the ring, Miss AMK. Yeah. 
Nice. And here comes Billy Parrigan, the Fumble World Television Champion. There's a different version of Billy Parrigan because I can't I can't download his other version. So I created my own version of him. And it's turned out to be a success. Because he's a former World TV champion. This guy couldn't even get in the main event last season. This season it's working out for him. The World Television Champion. Or former World TV Champion now. We'll be eyeing up to get his belt back. Cam Martin is in line for a title shot. So is the Big Amish. As well, but Big Amish is busy at the moment with uh, the ladder match. And he just had a big loss tonight. Losing to Ray Wolf. The Big Amish. In a losing effort to Ray Wolf tonight, so... Be interesting to see who is in line for that television title. But here we go. Mixed tag match. The Killers. I guess you could probably call them Liv and Killer himself. Against Colleen and Bailey Paragon. And if one of them tags out, if Colleen tags Billy, Killer comes in automatically. And vice versa. Killer going at the outside. What's she doing? What, already in the match? Already in the match? Oh my god, Power Bomb, Apron Bob on Colleen. Three. Elbow and a spear on Colleen. Colleen now back in the ring. Gets tangled up in the ropes in the process. Gotta love this game. And then goes to the outside and breaks the count. Killer now. Oh, Liv throws Colleen back in. Apron bomb to kick this off. Colleen in a little bit of trouble here. There's the neck breaker. Beautifully done. Masters now. I don't think there could be a double team. Maybe they can. I don't know. That's a suplex. And Killer. Tags Killer and here comes Paragon. Like I say, mixed tag match. Male versus males. Females versus females. So if Killer gets tagged in, which he has done there, Paragon comes in automatically. So either way, we're going to see Paragon one-on-one -on -one with Killer in this match. And Paragon looking to take care of Killer so far, but then Killer elbows him and then goes into an arm lock, hammerlock, takes an elbow right in the jaw. Paragon bouts him back. Oh, that neck breaker move there from Paragon. Cradle neck breaker. And the original Dirty Deeds, a.k.a. the one percenter. Boot to the midsection. Beautiful hook and rider from Paragon, the former world television champion. And now Killer has to come back in. Because here comes. Or Lift Killer has to come back in because now that's a stunner. Colleen's in, running. Colleen gets stunned. Boot to the midsection. Arm lock. Rocket drop, I suppose you can call that. Killer one step ahead of uh, Colleen at the moment. Oh. What's she going for here? The version of the sister Abigail. Caught one. Fucking Paragon comes in and just pulls. Killer pulls live right off Colleen for Pete's sake. Oh, double team. 
And a close line by Paragon. A close line on Paragon. Oh, and a super kick. Double super kick on both. Killers the legal man. One, two, and Paragon kicks out. Oh, the sting shot. Hurricane Rana. Excellent. Sleeper hold on Killer. Killer with a jawbreaker. Great matches tonight, man, for, for real. A great show for the time it's been on. Coming up next, though, the Wolves. The Women's World Championship main event. Oh, that, there's that knee. There's that knee. Killer in there. Referee. Fucking hell. What the hell was... Th oh, God. Bennett. Referee fucked that up there. Goes for the knee to the back. Killer moves out the way. And there... Da -da -da. Stunner. Took the world into a stunner. All around the world into a stunner. Whatever it is, it's effective nonetheless. One. Paragon kicks out. Nothing to worry about. Colleen. Paragon. Brought his colour back. Irish whip. I'm going to see a double team here. No one not. And an elbow, though. Right head to the gut. Paragon gets whipped into the corner. Are we going to see a double team again? Yes, we are. And a boot on Colleen. Lift killer, the legal person in there. And another super kick. Super kick. Referee, get down, you pea brain. One. Two, and Colleen kicks out. If we beat a pea brain as usual. Colleen, beautiful drop toe hold. Side suplex, oh. Liv gets stomped on the head, one. And not even a one count, you all right. Kick to the back. Paragon in a lot of trouble, killer. Liv killer. Caught up in Colleen. One. Backbreaker. Beautiful backbreaker. All around the world. Head scissors coming up. Which is usually the prelude to the, uh, the AMK. Referee goes down. One. And killer pulls Colleen off her. Paragon. Doesn't want to be tagged in, apparently. Right hand. Another side suplex. And now we've got to tag in Paragon. Yes, we are. Killer's back in. Boot to the midsection by Killer, though. There's that hammerlock. Hit a uh, rocker dropper. Killer in total control here. And Killer went for the Killer went for the clothesline and accidentally hit and accidentally hits Colleen and Colleen as cause of disqualification and Paragon and Masters get the victory. Controversial victory for Paragon and Masters in the cold main event. Referee won an idiot. So now we come down to this, your main event of this episode of GMW Underground. It is for the Women's Championship. Pennywise, who's been quite the participant here in GMW. She, she's 
She's had some good matches, and then she won the number one contender's fatal four way, which took place last week, if I'm honest. Um, here on Underground, she won a fatal four way last week to get this championship match. It is Pennywise, Mercedes, one on one for the Women's Championship. No disqualifications, no count outs. No nothing, no excuses. Pinfall submission take place in the ring. And yes, ladies and gentlemen, it is for the Women's Championship as well. No doubt Liv Killer will be looking on the, in this one as well, as well as Lady J and Colleen. Because all of the women will be eyeing up a match. I think what I'm going to do as well is this. I think I'm going to have this match next week. I think Cam Martin is going to get his wish. I think we're going to have some good main events next week. Uh, obviously, the world title is not going to be on the line next week. Because it's... The next time the World Championship match will rest, the World Championship will be on the line, will be at the pay-per-view. The Women's World Championship! There she is. Old Pennywise herself, the lady version of Pennywise, the daughter. The daughter of uh, that was psycho girl or what, I tell you. That I busted song. She's my psycho girl, my living nightmare. She probably is a living nightmare. The women's championship. God help me if this woman becomes women's champion tonight. There she is, the women's champion. Lord help me. The women's world champion. Here we go. From your darkest fears, the legend killer, Clown, the psycho maniac. She has more names than a. She has more names than I'll ever have. Let me tell you. Pennywise. The champion from Birmingham, Alabama. She is the Mercedes Donna Marie. Mercedes herself, the women's champion, Donna Marie Haynes. This is the women's championship match, the main event of the evening. And I've got three matches in mind for next week as well.
So here we go, main event, women's championship, Pennywise, the daughter of the mill. Daddy's probably watching this backstage, going one on one with Mercedes for the women's title. And it's no disqualifications too, by the way. Mercedes with the elbows. Right hand by Mercedes. Mercedes with the power. Into a slam. Gorilla press, gorilla press slam, but by the way. And another one. So nice we get to see it twice. And we do. Mercedes dominant so far. She is the women's champion for a reason. Just throws her. Just throws Pennywise across. Pennywise goes to the apron though. Elbow there. Oh, roll through. Pennywise in the corner with Mercedes. Mercedes in a little bit of trouble. Shot to the gut by Pennywise. What's she going for? Diamond dust. Headbutt. Referee, get in there. Kick to the gut. Pennywise in a little bit of trouble. But she's holding her own so far. For a face lock. Elbows. And Mercedes, what you going for? That's uh, Paige's finishing move. Elbow. Elbow. Luthes pressed by Pe Pennywise. Pennywise needs to get back into this match. It's no disqualifications, by the way. So she can go out and get a weapon. She gets a baseball bat. Nope, looking to swing. Misses. Mercedes gets that off her. And throws it down. Mercedes is like, I don't need a weapon to beat your ass. Half Nelson suplex. The women's champion dominant at this point in time. Go behind. Counter with the elbows. Like I said, the pinfall must take place in the ring. Ladies and gentlemen, the, the pinfall must take place in the ring. Or submission for that matter, whatever. Oh, and a, there's the baseball bat that Pennywise was looking to use. Clothesline by Pennywise. Rocks the women's champion. Pennywise needs to do better than that, though. And a power slam. I suppose a back body dropped on the uh, baseball bat. Goes for the choke slam. And hits it. Surely that's it. No disqualifications. One, two. Mercedes dominant in the women's championship match. And Mercedes is still your women's champion. Mercedes absolutely dominant and proven why she is the women's champions. She is the GMW Women's World Champion. Very impressive victory by Mercedes tonight. And that about wraps this up for this episode. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to go through a little uh, preview. I'm going to go through a little uh, recap. And also, I'm going to give you three matches for next episode, for the next week's show, February 20th episode of GMW Underground. You do not want to miss it because it's going to be the last one for two weeks because the following week will be the pay-per-view. And that's going to be streamed on uh, the channel, twitch.tv forward slash uh, games matter underscore. Last solo if we can get to a seat tonight against Cody. Also, 
my match with uh, Alex ended in a double card out, but it won't be this Tuesday because kicking off the episode this Tuesday, it'll be me and Alex one-on-one in a uh, Extreme Rules match as well. It'll be Extreme Rules this Tuesday. I say that I'm going to be the new World Heavyweight Champion. One way or another, I'm going to end this all. I don't all the paid money can buy. Cam Martin proves that he deserves to be a TV champion. Or deserves a shot at the world, at, at the championship because he beat Loco. I'll get to that in a second. John Moxley comes out and says he's going to retain no matter what and and make me regret what I did. But then I put him in the handicap match and my boys took care of it. A big win for Ray Wolf. A big win for Ray Wolf against the Big Amish. Uh, hopefully they'll get, get to do that again this Tuesday because this Tuesday it'll be Big Amish and Tuba Man taking on the Los Loco Lobos. This match ended in a disqualification because Curlo was going to go clothesline big Billy Paragon, but he, he hits Corley Masters and the referee calls it there for DQ. I think there's going to be a rematch between the, in this one. And as you clearly see there, Mercedes is still your women's champion. Also, right, Tuesday has already been set. There will be a tag match of Billy Pogan and, and not Billy Pogan, um, Tuba Man and Big Amish team up to face the Lost Local Lobos, Ray Wolf and, Pen and Punishment Martinez. Also, Local goes one-on-one -on -one with John Moxley this Tuesday as well. But next week on Underground, since it's going to be the last one for a couple of weeks uh, due to the pay-per-view being on the 27th, Next week, February 20th, GMW Underground, episode 6, has these three matches. We're going big. It's going to be a big show. We're going to have the World Tag Team Championships on the line. It's going to be War and Alex Seaver, granted he survives me this Tuesday. It's going to be War and Alex Seaver, the World Tag Team Champions. They will defend the titles this coming Saturday. On the underground against Punishment Martinez and Maximum Carlos. Punishment Martinez and Maximum Carlos will get a World Tag Team title shot next week on this program. GMW Underground. Also, the World Television title will be on the line as well. It will be... Uh -huh. It will be Cam Martin and he will challenge Loco Joe next Saturday, right here on this broadcast. Also, as well, I'm going to throw in this match. It is a rematch from this past Tuesday. That's right, it is a return bout from this past Tuesday, which was a Money in the Bank qualifier, which saw Big Amish win. But he'll have to do it big next week, because even though he lost to Ray Wolf this week, Next week on this program, and it's more likely going to be your television main event. It is the rematch from Tuesday. Andrew Eaton one on one with the Big Amish. The rematch from Tuesday. Go back and watch Tuesday's episode. It's up here on the page as well. Go back and watch Tuesday's episode on the page and go and watch that instant classic between Big Amish and Andrew Eaton. Can they replay it next to next Saturday here on the channel? We'll see. And also, next week, I'm more than likely going to do the uh, the rematch for the um, mixed tag match either Tuesday or Thursday, but next week here on the channel, on the Underground as well, it will be... So help me God. A cage match, a steel cage match between... Killer. Some sort of cage match next week. It's going to be Killer and Paragon one on one to settle this, hopefully, once and for all. Billy Paragon one on one with Killer next Saturday. So, like I said, the mixed tag match, the rematch for the mixed tag match will come this Tuesday or Thursday. Next week, it'll be a grudge match. I hope for, I don't know. I'm going to think of putting it in a uh, cage match, but next week it's going to be a grudge match 
Killer one on one with Billy Paragon next Saturday, right here. So that's four matches already made for next Saturday. The World Tag Team titles will be defended. The World Television title will be defended. Killer versus Paragon one on one in some sort of a stipulation match. It's more likely going to be a steel cage. I'll work it out during the week, but it's going to happen next week. And also Big Amish one on one with Andrew Eaton next week as well i cannot wait for that but thank you all so very much for the likes and the shares and whatever else you've done here this has been gmw underground more gmw this tuesday and thursday on the twitch channel twitch.tv forward slash games matter underscore i will be back probably if not monday probably next friday here on the channel as well i'll bust out some some premieres this week as well some uh, videos this week as well so look out for them on the page as well i'll probably be back on friday i know i'm tempted to go on twitch this monday um as well but i'll, I'll think about it over the weekend you'll see it when it pops up i'll schedule it if i'm on but I'll, if i'm not back on monday i'll definitely be back on friday and also i'll be back next saturday for more gmw underground stay safe guys thank you to everybody who's came by lurked and done all that good stuff i will see you when i see you peace out y'all stay safe enjoy the rest of your saturday and I'll be back next Saturday with GMW Underground, the final one for a couple of weeks before February 27th's pay-per-view. So see you next Saturday, guys, for more GMW Underground. Ta-ta!